6 at 6 30. Chad, great to have a Darius Bowman back in this morning. And uh, I think well, last season we talked to you, Darius. Oh, yeah, yeah. But, yeah, but it's awesome to have you here. Glad to be back. Glad to be back. Always. And, and it's always great to meet you guys in person because you don't really get the perspective on the field. We had the JC Sheridan last week. Oh, that's the man right there. That's he's the a man. great guy, yeah. Hey, he's bigger than what he looked, right? Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I was going to say, he was, I was surprised he's a little bit shorter than I am, even actually, but a lot more muscular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And defensive player of the week again. Uh, oh, man. Just, yeah. Two weeks straight, man. Yeah. Uh, oh, I, I, I can't say, uh, uh, that's been our, our, our MVP right now is our defense. Uh, just, just backing our offense up. Just, actually, just backing the whole team up with just the things we had. First time I was in, we was talking about the whole Ricky Roy, Stephen Giles, John, uh, switch, and we're, we're long past that now. And yeah. We're 4 and 2, uh, almost halfway through the season now. But uh, our defense are really playing like all stars, man. And I truly believe in the, the whole old Sam defense winning championship. You know, offense sells tickets. And I heard we sold a lot of tickets last, last game. So, uh, Everybody just continue to do what they're doing. We're gonna be all right. Well, when Saskatchewan comes to town, the ticket sales is oh true. always. That's, yeah, oh awesome. man, it yeah. was crazy. Yeah. It's so, crazy how they travel so many people around the oh, whole yeah, CFL. Like, yeah, there's nobody. I don't like, understand it. I, I was in Saskatchewan last weekend actually, uh -huh. and so uh, I stayed in Medicine Hat Friday night and listened to the game on Chip, watched the rest of it on TV, and I was thinking, oh man. That's the most pleasing win because yes. I've eaten crow all weekend. So it was, yeah. The press came Nobody said anything to me about the game. Was, was somebody? Awesome. Was anybody even there? Did yeah. Everybody come. <laughs> no, they were all here. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and, uh, so, well, how tall are you? Oh man, about uh, it changes by the day. I think I'm like six three, six four, six five. Okay, six, yeah. Six. <laughs> <laughs> so it goes from six three to six six. Yeah, something like that. I think. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> And for people who don't know, Darius has been out for the season. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yes, yes. But uh, Spears is great right now. I'm doing the old player coach thing a little bit. Uh, yeah. But the guys are, are doing great, man. I thought about leaving, doing some things, but I can't leave these guys, man. We put so much time and so much team chemistry in, man. It's uh, it's just it's unheard of. But, uh, yeah, man, some came along my way. Wasn't expecting, but I feel like a team, the organization, my family, my support, everybody's been supporting me well, and it's making it easier for me, you know. So uh, I appreciate it. Just look like I'll be spending some more time in Edmonton, so. Well, you're, you're it's just, a minus plus thing. It's you're, plus. You're yeah. gonna, you said you're going to spend the winter here? I'm here, man. First one. So. All right. Well, Let's do this together, yeah. everybody. Last <laughs> one was pretty good, so I'm hoping this one will be a uh, while yeah. for you. I heard about last one. It wasn't that bad. Yeah, so. no, it wasn't bad. I was hoping bad. for that again. So, so uh, Morley this morning was talking about how it's, it's good news that uh, Brendan Whitaker isn't going to be here, and I'm sure the other teams feel that way about you not showing up either. <laughs> I, hope place, so, so. I hope so, but I am yeah. glad that he's not here. Yeah. Yeah. And what was it? November 5th last year was a 225 yards, two touchdowns. Oh, Saskatchewan, yeah. 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 Those riders. Man. That was a great game. I know, love the game, man. Yeah. Love the game. Yeah. We'll have That's a lot more. It, a lot more in this career. It must drive you nuts, though. I mean, you, you must you, you jump not to be able to get back up. Oh, man, it was, to be honest, uh, feel a lot, not normal, you know, but uh, feel gross now. You know, I went through about a week or two of this. Actually, oh, why? Why? Why me? Yeah. Why? But it's life, you know, and uh, like I said, one door door closed, another one may open up, you know, so. Uh, you never know, so I'm always ready to prepare, you know. Can't stop and mope about something that's going on. You got to try to make the best of it, you know. I might end up in here with you working this well, out. Well, <laughs> well, that would be awesome. Sorry, I'm not done playing. But, uh, yeah, it's, uh, I it's need going great. Be good. But, but there is some good news because you, you were telling me that uh, your ACL, the doctor yeah. said it's not really torn. It's kind oh, of yeah. stretched. So it's up and down, man. So, uh, but I'm going to put a lot of faith in the doctors. You know, uh, it was like one of those hard cases. Nothing really tore completely, so... Just got to put my faith in them, put my faith in God, and we're going to go from there. And whatever's best for my career, we're going to do, you know, and whatever's best for the team, we're going to do. So uh, I'm just putting my faith in everybody and just yeah. continue to pray and keep good. my spirits good, high. Good, you good, know? yeah, keep praying. That's awesome. Now, you know, because once they go in and operate, you never know. Uh, so, you never know, you know. So that's the thing. Yeah, it could heal by itself, you're saying. That. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, I don't know. I feel like I got a very, very strong body, you know. So yeah, yeah. I kind of want to go with that. But I got to listen to the doctors. I'm not a doctor. I feel like one sometimes. So they call me <laughs> Dr. AD. But uh, it's going great. <laughs> well, and then you mentioned, like, assistant, you're doing some coaching now. On the oh, yeah, I feel like a coach, so, man. So tell me a little bit about Corey Boyd. How, oh, yesterday man. was his first day. How did he fit in? Uh, I met him uh, yesterday morning. Uh, haven't seen haven't seen much, but uh, I've been hearing all these rumors, all these stories around town. But I know as an Eskimo, he's, his selects clean right now. You know, mm -hmm. uh, he haven't had a problem with us. And uh, <clears throat> practice was great yesterday. Got to kiss the end of it. So uh, looks like he's, he looks ready. I like the fit. He looks good. Yeah. There you go. You know. <laughs> so uh, I like everything, man. That's the one thing I love about Coach Cavins and Mr. Tillman, man. Is uh, they're always doing what's best. You know, it might not look 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 that great when you first see it, but. Uh, uh, just the first day that we spent with that guy, he, he seems pretty focused, you know. For some 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 players, it takes a change, and yeah. you, you can find home. And I, 
I, I came to realize that Edmonton seems to be like everybody home lately, so uh, we're welcome to man, man, so we, uh, I'm lot, glad he's here. We, we have a lot of players that have come here and just planted the roots oh, and yeah. stayed afterwards. Yeah, so. I think I'm one. I, I hope, I hope <laughs> not. We'd love to have you, absolutely. Well, it's going to be tough to get rid of. <laughs> is he, is he, I mean, you played for so many careers. Uh, oh, yeah. Your college career was in North Carolina, Oklahoma. Oklahoma State, and, yeah, yeah. Have, have you ever had been dropped into a, a team mid-season? Corey was. You have to learn the playbook oh, and all that kind of nah, stuff. Nah, man, and that was a uh, that was one of the things we was telling him. Like, uh, it was like, man, guys was joking when we first got here. Like, hey, man, tell us all the Toronto's plays. You know, he was like, oh, no, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> but uh, I bet it is uh, like a hard situation. Like mid season, you know, you go from being here thinking this is home, and then sometimes it feel like the blink of an eye. You, you're always on, always on the other side of sure. the country. You know, playing for another team, but uh, haven't really experienced it. But man, like my head goes off to him. Like I say, uh. I've only spent the day with him. I got his number and stuff. Uh, seemed like a great guy, man. I love, mm -hmm. I love the way he carries himself, you know. Like I said, I, you hear talk, you know what I mean? But I can't believe it. I can go by what I see. So uh, right now he's clean with the Eskimos, and, and everybody's excited about it. Seems like a great attitude. Great attitude, man. Player, and I love seeing him him and Hugh Charles in the backfield. Yeah, yeah. Dangerous. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's, <laughs> yeah, there's trouble for Dangerous. the other teams. So, uh, Absolutely. Yeah, plus for the Eskimos. That's what I say. Yeah, yeah. I, you're right. <laughs> Uh, Friday night is military night. Oh, yes. I guess he does, so. Please come out and support yeah. the troops. We got, uh, <coughs> we're giving our uh, T-shirts. Uh, Capital, Capital, uh, Power. Capital Power is doing uh, mm. T-shirts at the door, and we're taking donations for the T-shirts, and a minimum, a minimum of five dollars. Uh, Capital Power is going to match every 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 dollar we sell. So uh, wow. come out. All the money will go back to the troops. So uh, come out and support, man. Got to support the troops. Yeah, they've got that family resource center. Oh, yeah, that's right. Dollar Pass. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. So, anyway, it's, it's going to be a great game. Still lots of tickets left, I'm sure. Oh, come, come, come. Yeah. What's today? Tuesday? Wednesday? Wednesday. Wednesday. That's right. A few more days. Come on. All right. Okay. <laughs> well, yeah, you're a great ambassador for the team. In fact, I, I think Dwayne Vianney is a little worried about his job. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, he's a man. That's, that's the boss right there. <laughs> all right. Uh, Darius, we appreciate all you appreciate do for the city. All the time. All the time. And tell us about us. Every time. 448S and for Dwayne, uh, yes, there is an app that you can download as well. <laughs> yeah, of everything that's happening. Apps in the world right now. There you go. All right. Thank you, Darius. Good to see you. Appreciate y'all. Say 54. Yeah, yeah.